How to say in Chicago Turabian style. Hi, I'm Chris and I work in the library. You know, when you're writing a research paper, you have to cite your sources. Uh, oh, come on now, it, it's not that hard, really. Step one insert a numeric endnote marker within your paper whenever you want to let your reader know you're going to cite a source. You can use Microsoft Word to insert a marker. Click Insert EndNote on the References tab. Also, make sure you're using Arabic numerals, you know, the normal ones, rather than Roman numerals. Okay. Step 2. Indicate the source of your information in an EndNote at the end of your paper. EndNotes must include certain citation details in a certain order with specific formatting. The book I'm demonstrating starts with the EndNote number, then includes the author's first and last name, followed by a comma, the title of the resource in italics, the publication information in brackets, followed by a comma, and then lastly, a page number which refers to where the info making up the current citation was found in the book. The details for each type of source, magazines, websites, etc., generally follow this pattern, but there are key differences and exceptions, too. Relax! I'll give a link to further resources to help with this at the end of the tutorial. Okay. Back to work. Step 3. Keep writing your paper, adding new information and inserting endnote markers where you need them. And at the same time, you're citing the details about your sources with corresponding endnotes at the end of your paper, even if it's the same source as a previous endnote. Step 4. After you've finished writing, you need to add a bibliography that lists each source once. Your list will be much longer, but here, I'll throw in another source, just to demonstrate. You probably notice there's differences between an endnote and a bibliography entry, like note number, no note number, author's first name and last name versus author's last name, then first name, commas up here, periods down here. And there are more differences, too, but let's not go crazy on the details. The point is, you have to ensure you're citing with accuracy. That's it! Easy, right? Now that you know the basics, you've got some time to take a nap or, or sing a song. Whatever. You're still going to have to learn all the rules for putting together citations to different source types, and also the formatting differences between EndNotes and the bibliography, so you should probably head on over to our Chicago Turabian webpage for more information. The link's on the screen there. So long!